CHF on Femina Miss India 2013 just got bigger and grander. 23 contestants, but only three lucky girls took the crowns home. Well, it was an enviable lineup of judges and also a very starry red carpet. All in all, an entertaining 50th Pond Femina Miss India event. Why don't you go take a look? Almost as excited as these three gorgeous ladies with their beautiful crowns here. Guys, how does it feel? It's amazing. I have goosebumps right now. <laughs> I feel on top of the world. And I still can't believe it I've won. It's it's something something out of this world, something you've you've always dreamt of becoming uh, Miss India. And when that happens to you, it is just you have no words to say. You just want to enjoy that moment. Right, I'm going to ask the most obvious question. How was the feeling when your name was announced? Did you expect this? I was hoping that they take my name and when they did, I, I don't know, I, I blacked out for a second. I, I couldn't feel a thing right. and, and I was just walking. It was like mind body got a mission fail. I was just going there and, and they crowned me and I walked and I could see the cameras flashing and right. I could feel my heartbeat thumping against my chest. It was the most beautiful feeling. Right. I think Navneet, you were really taken aback. You know, I saw the look in your face and you were like overjoyed on cloud nine. How was the feeling? Oh, well, it was like a dream come true. The feeling was, I actually cannot remember what the feeling was because it was just for that moment and I can never forget that feeling but I cannot express that in words. But it was the most fe uh, beautiful feeling that has ever happened to me. And Zoya, so yeah, yours was actually the first name to have been announced. Yes. The five of you were standing and it was really quick. Yes, actually I would say, I, w I took a deep breath and I was like, okay, please call 23, please call 23. And when they did, I was like, oh my God, this is... This is this is my time and I would enjoy it like totally. Tell me rewind a little bit, you know, from the time when you all ant entered the right. sub pageants and you know, you all came from different cities. You hail from Chandigarh, is that right? Yeah, yeah I'm from Chandigarh. Take Chandigar. us back to that and what was the feeling like? Uh, well, I won uh, Fe uh, Femina Miss India Chandigarh and that was another beautiful feeling. But since, the, uh, since then I've been hoping that yes, I would win this someday and the day is right here. I'm so. still love Chandigarh beauty is winning this pageant, huh? Yeah, last year's Vanya. Vanya was also from Chandigarh and now you're from Chandigarh. So. Oh yeah, and that, and that is what I wanted. I wanted Vanya to crown me someday. So oh, and it, 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 is like, come true. it is like a dream come true for me. But I have to ask you, Rangada Singh, were you a tough judge? Me? No, hardly. I swear, I think all those girls, it needs a lot of heart to come up and, you know, just to know that every single pair of eyes sitting here are judging them and wanting to check whether you're number one or number ten. It's is just so hard. So I was just actually, honestly, I don't know if you can play back, but I was just smiling. I was just looking at them like, well done, you know, really. But what was your criteria like? You know, for me, I think the right amount of confidence and comfortable, you know, like when you see somebody comfortable and within their confidence, I think for me that's very attractive in a person. I was actually the sweetest judge because I really hate judging. I don't like it. First of all, I've judged all my life. Hmm. To even start dance in India, I was like, judging, judging. Right. So I never like to judge. But right. what I did was, I did what I feel would be best for them. Right. Uh, not even here, but internationally, Bollywood, everywhere. So right. it was not only about the only prettiness, it was about everything. It's all right. a you know, combination of everything. But I just tell you one thing, I never judge harshly. I can't. How can you judge? I, I like her, he likes him. How can you say we're wrong? But if you have to judge, we judge it. John, now you gave a lot of girls like blushes on stage, we could make that out, but were you a tough judge? Well, I, um, I think we all knew, uh, I mean, I, in retrospection, we all knew that Navneet is going to, uh, she's a strong contender and uh, the deserving girl won, but um, like I said, congratulations to all of them who took part because they're all confident, hard-working girls. They were calling you Mr. Cappuccino. Who would you date if you were given a chance out of these three? I think they're all sweet girls and I was a judge and I'd, I'd, I'd love to assume the position of a, of a judge now. Now, he was 
We're batting on a very different pitch today. I am with Yuvraj Singh. How was the evening, Yuvraj? Was it tough to judge these beautiful girls? Very tough wicket to bat on. I think uh, the girls did really well. But I, I, I think the best one uh, won the crown. So your favourite won the crown? I think so, because uh, she's Punjabi and I'm hi, Punjabi. Hi. I'm not being biased, but uh. other girls are also very pretty. But uh, I think she deserved to win. Now that was just a sneak peek of all the highlights from this prestigious event. We will be bringing you a whole lot more from the France Feminine Miss India 2013 pageant. So stay with us on Time Sound.